As war in Ukraine continues, people from all over are showing their support and standing by Ukrainians. Some Russians are feeling torn because of the invasion, loving their home country, but sad it's creating conflict. While some people from Russia are supporting President Vladimir Putin, many more are against the war and protesting to stop it. Eleni Dow introduces us to one Russian student vocal about his disapproval of the crisis in Ukraine. More and more Ukrainians are running away from their home because of the invasion. As people all over the world are watching, those closer to it, people from Russia are feeling heartbroken as they bear witness to what their country is doing. From Eastern Europe to Eastern Washington, people protesting against Russia's invasion in Ukraine. Gregory Demon is one of them. He was born and raised in Moscow, Russia. Demon moved to Spokane in 2017 with his dad and brother to go to Eastern Washington University to major in film. However, school's been a little more difficult recently as his home country invades Ukraine. For the last five days, I uh, couldn't really sleep well, you know, because I'm always checking news. This is the worst thing can happen. His mom and other brother are still in Russia. He talks to his mom every day, who also says she just wants peace. I wasn't really afraid for them uh, till that uh, comments of Russian government about nuclear weapon. Every day now, he continues to look at the Ukraine crisis, not knowing how he can help from Spokane. It's been a tough week for him, this war creating conflict within his friends. I already can say that I kind of, you know, lost two friends uh, in that meaning that we have uh, different perspectives here. He knows he's on the right side, feeling for the Ukrainians, and knows it's not good for his home country too. No matter what will happen, how this war will end, it will uh, affect Russian people so badly. Demon worries for his mom. His mom worries for him and his brothers too. Demon says they've been, there have been Russians who are being harassed because of the conflict. He says he hasn't been on the receiving end of it yet. In studio, Eleni Dow, 4 News Now.